The Israeli army has forcibly removed a group of Palestinian farmers from their land in the occupied West Bank. The farmers from the Tokoa village were trying to plant 400 olive trees on their land with the help of a Christian youth group when the Israeli soldiers stopped them at gunpoint and asked proof of ownership. After holding them for over one hour, and despite the farmers proving ownership of their land, the Israeli forces ordered them to leave the area and never come back unless they had a specific reason or an official order. The Israeli settlers and soldiers have seized over a thousand denims from our land since 2001. When the farmers tried to plant on their land, they were immediately prevented by Israeli soldiers who claim the land is too close to a settlement. But we know they only want to seize the entire area to expand their settlements. The farmers said that the land in question were 90 denims or 22 acres and were owned by four families living in al Asakira village. They said that they had worked with an Israeli lawyer to acquire a warrant in order to access their lands, but that Israeli authorities have refused to abide by the court's decision and instead cooperated with the settlers to take control of their lands. I have nine dunams of land here. During the second intifada, we were forced to flee from the area while the Israeli settlers and soldiers destroyed our crops and trees. Two months ago, we went to a lawyer and asked them to take our case to the Israeli court. They told us that the land belongs to us. Yesterday, we went there to plant trees, but Israeli soldiers told us to go away and asked to see our documents. Khaled explained that the land is encircled by Israeli settlements and that there is a continuous presence of the Israeli army in the area. He explained that the farmers have been under constant attack by the Israeli settlers living in the area. Although the Palestinian farmers have proof of ownership of their land, they are forbidden to access it. And if they try, they are forcibly removed at gunpoint by the Israeli soldiers. They blame this on the illegal settlers living nearby who want to expand their settlements. Nelburn for Press TV, Occupied Bethlehem.